Hi everybody, it's Ray, it's Life and Vibe, and I have a little bit of a challenge I have set myself for this week, and it is to react to each one of Sarasota Tim's videos that he puts out for an entire week, starting today, Monday, and it will end on Sunday night. So I am going to do this mammoth challenge, and I mean mammoth, and so I don't expect everybody to watch all the videos. I'm just more interested to start to hear kind of the pattern of the conversation. I know he said he's expecting company from out of town. Just, just trying to find out the fascination of what his 63.3 thousand subs are watching, um, but maybe not as many as he thinks. So just going to put out my fair use real fast. I am a registered nurse with over 10 years experience, but currently I am getting ready to continue with my study as a psychiatric mental health nurse practitioner. I have about a year to go um, before graduation. So just to let you know, I am not treating or diagnosing anybody here. This is just for entertainment purposes only. And really just to kind of take a little bit of a look at this person uh, in regards to the cult of personality that he potentially has. Um, there's a very interesting a uh, report that I've been reading, a study about that. And so I might start bringing that in a little bit more. So yeah, let's just make sure um, we know what we might be here for today. Take it away, Judge Matt. <laughs> I simply asked. I said, I wish I could have this dry bacon. Well, I mean, how do you know what that is? No, no. I simply asked. Yeah, <laughs> we know what that is, Tim. We know what that is. Okay, so we don't know. Uh, there was a lot of uh, thoughts about the coffee yesterday uh, that he never videos anything in regard to him paying it forward with the coffees. So we hear a lot of talk about it, but it's the one time he seems to respect the privacy of others is when he's buying those uh, very expensive McDonald's coffees. So today we've started out, oh my goodness, what a challenge this week. It's probably going to be at some point commenting on a three hour golf game. Um, I am going to make sure that I've always sped him up to 1.25. Uh, if it's a little fast, pop the subtitles on because we got to pump out this content along with Tim this week. Um, it's been out for an hour. He's had uh, 530 views. So either most of his audience is not up yet with him or they have very little uh, interest of golf with Timmy Apple Valley at El Rio Golf Club, Fort Mojave, Arizona. Succinct title, Tim. Okay. I have no idea. Uh, let me just see what it looks like. I'm going to bring me down smaller. There we go. Uh, Tim, I've set myself one heck of a challenge this week. Oh, my goodness, everybody. It's We'll see what the common words uh, in this thread. I'm fascinated to know what's going to happen to my mind after watching Tim's entire content of videos for an entire week. And like I said, if you like this type of content, well, maybe I haven't. Hit the likes, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Okay, Tim, take it away. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Sarasota Tim and Timmy Apple Valley here at El Rio Golf Club in Fort Mojave. It is nice and warm today, but not too bad at all. It's 1.30 p.m. We're heading to the driving range. Uh, Timmy hadn't played in a little while. We're going to hit the range, try to work on the uh, striking the ball and get comfortable. And we're just going to go out and do a little practice round, that's all, and have a good time. I'm so glad to have Timmy with me today. He's going to be here for the next few days. We plan on playing at least a couple of rounds, and we're going to be somewhere different uh, tomorrow and maybe even Mojave. But I think we want to get over there to uh, Lake um, – uh, not Lake um, – Laughlin Ranch, uh, like on my hat here. <laughs> so uh, anyway, stay tuned. We're going to go out here to the range, and we're going to get out there and have some fun. Crush it. Anyway, folks, take a look. Oh, my goodness. I thought he bought – whose shoes are these? Are these Timmy Apples? Valleys? Or are these another pair of shoes that Tim bought? Because I thought he bought a, a pair that looked more like a formal man's golf shoe. Mm, he is really taking off with this golf stuff. 
I mean, he is just, he really is one of these people, like, he supposedly did this in Boynton Beach, but then he was known as the grifter of Boynton Beach or the loafer or something, I allegedly. Timmy's got his Nike golf shoes on. Oh, I got my foot joys. We got oh, our golf God. shoes. We're twins, okay. Yeah, we're ready to go, oh, man. Oh, wait, I got to make it. Got nothing. Yeah. I got nothing on me. I mean... I, I don't want to take away from Tim's joy. I just find it very interesting how excited a 65-year-old man is that uh, two people have golf shoes on uh, to go out and play golf. Um, I guess having uh, been not a massive golfer, but I did golf enough to the point where it meant that I did need to necessitate purchasing a pair of golf shoes, uh, some clubs because I was taking lessons and I was going out and pair playing a fair amount. I mean, it was not expensive. I mean, it was still a lot for me because I've never been a huge earner, uh, but it was inexpensive enough uh, that I could see that I could, you know, potentially, you know, ask for, you know, lessons as a birthday gift from my parents or something at the time, probably. <laughs> But he just seems overly excited. Um, the other gentleman sounds a little embarrassed, but he's just showing off the shoes that he got, as we know, through his buy me a coffee, because the gentleman sent him $150 because he sent 30 coffees and then asked if Tim needed more, just to let him know. I got an F. I got an F, F J. I got a little thing right there. You can't read the rope. I can't read it. Anyway, here we are at the driving range. Hundreds of balls available to hit. They're all waiting for us. Oh, they've changed it and put them on little platforms now. They took the big uh, boxes away. There's there's one box left. So right down here in Parallel Park. Uh, they had several of those black boxes all along there yesterday, day before. And now they've just put a few out here. Uh, but that's plenty of balls. Let's go hit them. Yeah, that's all you got. Right to that bunker down there. Straight down is where you want to go. All right, so we played one hole. And, uh, now, usually, if anybody knows about the etiquette of golf, if you're trying to get your ball um, lined up and ready to hit, you kind of want it to be as quiet as possible because you're thinking through your shot, especially with this. It sounds windy. So I'm not sure if they're against the wind or with the wind at this point. And that can make a lot of difference, too, on your golf swing. Uh, you may not want it to go too far. And Tim just yab yabbing away, and he is very excited. You can hear him very excited. Well, I do have a sped to 1.25, I did want to preface that. Uh, but I think more really with him having somebody who's there, so he'll be able to be filmed and show his golf strokes. Anyway, let's keep going. He's out, uh, he's just warming up. He, did, he got a bogey, and I got a bogey. He's got them heavily medicated. Yeah, there you go. And then, um, this is the uh, par five number two here at the uh, El Rio Golf Club. And it's all he's got in his bag uh, down to that bunker. He's got his uh, Callaway driver out. He's going to show us how it's done. I didn't see it. Would he go left? All right, it's probably findable over there. He was like, just trying to right take here. that moment. That Grandmaster. Him from talking. Let's see if this guy ruins Tim's game the same way Tim tried to ruin him. Look at Tim here. Oh, I don't tall. Uh, what's Miss Tamby's millions, allegedly? Dead center. <laughs> I love this driver. What? And like Timmy's second shot here is far five. Well, one, I apologize because the wind makes it sound terrible. <laughs> and two, he is just wanting to show off all of his new hats, probably sponsored by whatever he's trying to be sponsored by, the buy me a coffee folk, his clothes. Now he just allegedly needs Miss Tammy's millions so he can get a house along a golf course and he can park his RV out there. Oh, just very, you know. <laughs> I mean, it looks beautiful out there. I'd be excited too. I'm in my house responding to Tim's content <laughs> on my stream yard. A little less glamorous. <laughs> oh my God, what a what shot, Timmy. 
Nice, brother. That's nice. I got the three hybrid here. Let's get a lot of sun, though. God, I hope he's got sunscreen on. Second shot. Thank God we got this better. <laughs> okay. We made a nice sound. It's all right. You're straight. Oh, if it went for that car path, checking it up, it gone further. All right, you can pause it. Oh, here's Timmy's third shot, par five. Did you get it on the green? Nice to to he's just obsessed with golf. Ooh. Have it burns his he pulls it left. It's heading towards the bunker. I think this is third shot, eight iron. We'll bump and run. Three. What's the power for this? Five. I hope it's straight. Uh, and it was too much. I mean, <laughs> watching two guys. Like, this is like the people that are behind you at the golf course. <laughs> I mean, this is what he decided. All right. You're on the uh, frame. We got a real short, a short par three here at El Rio Golf Club. Timmy's up on the tee box. I got a par on the par I mean, five. He got a bow. How many holes? It's our we practice round. Ball. First round for Timmy in quite a while. I'm stabbing. This <laughs> is. <laughs> nice shot. Oh my gosh. He's dancing on the dance floor, folks. Good shot, Tim. Yeah, I was that say it was And you're using a pitching wedge as I steal information from the golf master. Let's see. Get our line. How is he just like lines? <laughs> How is he throwing himself on there like that? Why is he just throwing his shot on? Missed something. The mulligan? Going on. It's up straight. Ooh, bounce. I missed whatever that oh, was. Copying Timmy me. Timmy did better. Well, I'm a little bit behind Tim. It's all right. Uh, well, I guess I'm not, I got about 50 feet. You're about 10 feet off the green. Oh, yeah. But I should ship it. Uh, okay. <laughs> Good speed. Oh, that was. Uh, well, see, I forget. I'm at 1.25. I was like, this is a little fast. <laughs> you set the table there. Oh, my grandfather used to love to play golf. You should have zoomed in on that. That's amazing. Folks, look at that. Okay. That it's is something. There's a second. Oh, my goodness. 28 minutes. I guess we get to see, like, how many holes. Gosh, Tim. Gosh, no wonder it only has 500 views. But we have challenged ourselves to an entire week. And it could be a lot of strenuous watching of golf. Par. I'll get up here and video my YouTube algorithm. Uh, Timmy coming up. That was 50 feet, 10 feet off the green. Look at that. Come on up, Timmy. I'll move my ball if I have to. Look at that. He hits it. He's coming. Look at his putt. Not too bad. All right. Still your shot for his par. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I hope after this is the I hope this is. He reads the green. Seriously, you have to be loving some golf to want to watch two amateurs hitting out their golf out here at El Rio. <laughs> my hobby, wherever they are. Can't even remember the name. <laughs> oh. Nice bogey. Yeah. That's fine. Bogies are your friends. Over okay. here. Okay. Video this okay. so amazing. Whatever. Let's get a good perspective. Okay. Yeah. And he went back too far. Nice. Really. Ah. Man, that was and an amazing. A hundred dollar shirt. And, Let's talk about it some more. And so, Tim, you know, it's been a while since you played. Are you enjoying yourself after just a few holes? Another pain pill. <laughs> That's killing me. What's hurting on you? We got some uh, wind here coming in on the microphone, but uh, it's not bad out here, is it? The heat? No, the breeze. I mean, it's nice. Man. Quit yelling at me. <laughs> Stop yelling at me. Uh -huh. Oh man, the shade right there. Okay, uh, this is. Uh, yeah, this poor guy is like got Tim just trying to yell over the wind so that he can be picked up on his uh, microphone as he's filming everything. Poor Timmy can't even come out and have a relaxing 
game of golf with all friends Sarah said to him due to the fact that he has to film and make content out of everything. And the only thing that stops it from becoming content is when his camera overheats or when he is allegedly giving uh, coffees to people and paying it forward because he doesn't want to video those private moments. We never see that. We only ever hear the stories of people not thanking him or that he, you know, did his little phone three times. I guess, you know, because he's using his phone for Apple Pay, he can't film. Is that the reason? Well, then pay in cash and let us see it happen. Change the way you pay. But no, he's got to involve his app in it because, you know, Timmy's a cheapskate, allegedly. What? What do we got here on the card? What does it say? Is it par four? Dude, my eyes are dead. All right, so we got it figured out. Uh, this is the score. I'm two over. He's shooting straight bogey. This is a par five we're getting ready to hit. 492 yards. 500 yard par five. Straight away. Let's go, Tim. Let me see you hit it. Crush it, buddy. Let me play the yeah, There's a mic on. I think the wind's going to pick up and cause wind noise. Everybody's going to be aggravated. If you hear this, then, then walk away. How close are you to this man trying to line up a shot? Finally, Tim, I'm realizing it is quiet. <laughs> nice shot. That sounded good. It's in the grass. It's in the fairway. Yes. I see it. That's fine. Keep my head straight. Keep your head straight. Your head down. That was my problem. Keep your head around. Yeah, said, keep your head straight, boy. He's a good man. Tim's trying to look like he has a prison job once in his life and a 401k. Not that he's on his $1,700 a month. SS. Sorry, folks. I'm saying it wrong. <laughs> I'll admit it. Oh, that sounds Terrible. A lot of dirt. Oh, I should be to the left. Though. I know that. But not that the fact that it was a far ball, down. but it was not a uh, in regulation shot. In my opinion, it's over this brown rough stuff. We'll show you. We get up there. So par five is second yeah, shot. Got a thin lie on this barren part of the fairway. <laughs> it's off the fairway, actually. <laughs> Thank God I sped this content off. <laughs> I need to go get the best cup of coffee after this. Pulls it left. To keep me but he gets it. He advances it. All right, it's on some good grass over there. All right. Oh, I see two balls right over here. I don't know which one of those are. Let's go find them. Let's go look at them. They had to be out fairly early this morning because this was posted before. Oh, this is at in Arizona. This was. Before 9 a.m., I believe it was posted here in the East Coast. So um, I'm I'm just going to plead ignorance right here um, in order to keep this thing going. I'll find out later what the time difference is. But they were out early trying to beat the sun, I guess. There's nobody really out there. This It's a Monday. So good time to play. I guess the, the rates are low. I don't know. Ah, jeez. 11 minutes feels like an eternity already and i have this thing sped up to 1.25 <laughs> no. keep going guys oh my goodness i think it's gonna be the whole golf game summed up yeah that was good there you go there's a golf shot in the fairway oh timmy's handing me my butt on this hole my second shot out of the rough is back in the rough i didn't reach the fairway Mm, right there. See, I'm more particular than a watcher. So this is all for me just to be watching people. Watch I am doing something. Look at the jungle. Tim. There he is. On the right, well. That's decent. It's a big ball first, but it's called the bad good shot. It goes right down the middle. Still roll. That was his fourth shot. How many shots are we going to see in this? Oh, that was nice. It's going right at it. Go, go, go. Yes, look at that. It's going to go in the hole. Good 
just shot and we're on. I'm gonna say that's what he he didn't get into whatever that was. What was that? It was... Ooh, a little heavy. Get enough practice Run. at this point. You're out there every day. Yeah, five times a day. <laughs> so it's Timmy okay. and Tim. Takes his eye off the ball too quick. How do you edit yeah, this? Can we edit it now? No, let's not edit it. Let's show everybody. It does. He takes his go. eye off the ball too quick. He's impatient. Here's a flop shot. Nice. It's gonna, I'm gonna take, keep your eye on the ball. Now, when did you, I get you, old? You came up too quick. When did it all After about change? five, I made it. I was 10 feet tall and everybody knew my name. <laughs> There's Hody Tim. Well, we show it to you around here, folks. We don't edit around here. I forgot what I'm lying. Except when you buy a lot of people, folks. Here, that's my putt. We never see that. Very windy. Apologize. Oh, it's killing your ears. Get in the hole for me. Nice. Yes. What the heck? Save one. How did you do that? <laughs> I got two lucky shots after four or five bad ones in a row. Let me see he makes his bogey. Well, all kingdom play. Yeah. Yeah. This is this is for bogey, right? You on five? Oh, okay. I believe you're gonna make it. Cool. Oh, damn! Give me some, dude. That was great, brother. I thought I missed. Wait, that's, that's a good up and down. Man. That is a good up and down, folks. This guy played. I won't tell you how long. You won't tell him. I think my back's gonna hold up, brother. Oh, I'll take another. Yeah, he probably knows how to play, and he's got to deal with Timmy and his 15 swings to get to the hole. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Goodness me, we're halfway through this video, guys. More than halfway. Oh, I used to play golf, so... <laughs> and I'm trying to get interested in this. Oh, my goodness. But I, I am going to challenge myself this week. We just happened to start out with golf. That's where we started this Monday. I mean, the green looks great. The rest is very dry. Okay, keep going, guys. We're almost done. My audience is not going to want to know what to do with this content. Oh, the pain pills. <laughs> well, anyway, that's a great hole. He's shooting straight bogey. And I got, I don't know, triple on that or something. Let me let me add them up. All right, we're on hole number five. It's 116 yard par three. I don't know. I got lost again. We got... We've played more holes than we've written down scores. Oh, and I forgot to mention, if I look like red-eyed and all funky in this one eye, I was fighting with my contact lens prior to getting on camera. That's what took me so... Oh, I need to get some eye drops. So we wrote down more scores than we played holes. Because we're not drinking. <laughs> Something's not right. This, this course has got me messed up. There's so a team. Tim Cup, whatever name you want. Sweet. Millionaire Tim. Wow. Tim the homeowner. <laughs> Excited about Miss Tammy's money, allegedly. All right, everybody. The iPhone is definitely trying to shut off quite a bit mm. uh, from the heat out here. I don't feel hot. The phone feels like iPhones are very sensitive to heat. I will let you know if your iPhone is your primary camera to film out in the heat, you're going to want something else because they are not fans of the heat. And uh, he's going to chip it on the green. He's got that part of the flag. I'm on the green. Part three. Hole number five. Oh, not bad. Not bad. He's pin high. There you go. Phone keeps shutting. It's still running. Let's get this putt. Come on, smoke it. Mm. Look at Tim and his. I'm I'm a millionaire. Thanks to my subscribers. His skin says something else. Yeah, video keeps shutting off. 
<laughs> to go buy something from some kind of camera. Just what I said. Yes. You know what? And and surprisingly, Tim, you have been sent hundreds of dollars to have probably a better camera <laughs> through your buy me a coffee. So if you're so concerned about the quality of your content, then why don't you purchase yourself a nice new camera? I do my stream yard from my laptop because I do commentary. So I'm not worried about trying to get out and have a great camera for outdoors. But I do want to be able to make sure that I have half decent equipment in the house. Um, and this is what I got. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, you've been sent lots of money. Um, so you're gonna if you want to be out in this uh, Arizona heat or Nevada heat or any of these places, I can let you know that the iPhone is not going to be a happy camper. You need to get a cooler box and you need to keep that thing, you know, inside the cooler box, uh, keeping a little bit, you know, cool while you go between hot places. Because even here in Virginia Beach already, mine has been saying within just a few minutes of me just having it in the car and not really doing anything with it. I mean, really, just having it in the car, saying it's, it's getting hot. So, and I have to put it up near the air conditioning then. So, yeah, investment time, Tim. Tea off earlier in the morning during the night spot, Jimmy. That's good. Pick that up. It's good for your bogey. Timmy's playing solid bogey. Here, get my putt for me. Come on. It's still on. This is for par. Nice. Definitely improved your putting somehow. Another par five. Here's Timmy's big drive. Nice knowing not to speak <laughs> for this guy. Pulls it hard left. Here, here comes. Look at me. I'm 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 dressed like I have a 401k and a prison job. <laughs> Tim. That's great. I mean, he's been playing every day recently. Oh, That's about five feet off the ground. All right, we have finished the front nine, and now we are going for the back nine, everybody. Uh, Tim and Timmy here uh, at El Rio Golf Club in Fort Mojave, Arizona, at about 4 o'clock straight up. And it's probably about 100 degrees. Feels very nice. And low humidity, no humidity. No oh, his skin is very concerning to me. I feel that he gets out in the sun a lot, and he doesn't really take care of his skin. Mm. That You need sunscreen. It's you're gonna get issues if you're not already having issues, if I remember correctly. We're sweating, and we did a good warm up round in practice. First time he's played in a while. This is for the bar. This is for the money right here. A hundred a hole. Pokes it out there in the fairway. Good shot. Safe. Here we go. Hundred a hole. Are they playing for money? Is Tim using his buy me a coffee money? <laughs> To play, uh, you know, like gambling on the course, or is he just joking? Because I mean, that's why you know, guys who really want to show if they're, they're balling, I know will play money on holes. I'm sure. I mean, just because you know, a little bit of competition, a little money involved, you know. But is he joking about the hundred a hole? I mean, with his money, I mean. Shoot, I mean, there was a day where he got 53,000 views from just pumping out content, and getting probably full to five. I mean, I, he'll get it if he puts out enough. Let's see what he does today. Let's see what he does to my algorithm. Good Lord. Oh. I'm scared for mine. I think I see it. Pretty tough. <laughs> not when did that I get old? Oh, so I when apologize. did everything change? I was 10 feet Jim's tall and everybody knew my name. Is there a sort of team? Uh. I don't think there's anything I can do sound wise. Eradicate that background noise. Yeah. I think it's just my thought just being really cute over there. Under the hole, we're not messing around. 
Give me a second uh, shot. I wish I could show you how cute my dog is. I'm going to try to get my studio fixed up. So you hit the I big ball first, but you got a good shot out of it. Show how adorable my dog Still is going. sleeping on a couch. Oh, you won't believe this, but Timmy and I are both away. laying four. Sorry. All right, par four. <laughs> and we're that far from the hole. This is ugly. <laughs> we got very distracted away from the ball and over to the dog. Tim's probably horrified this guy's matching Nike shoes with NBA basketball. Nice putt. Nice. <laughs> oh. Probably horrified. <laughs> like, how can you not be out here and match everything? Like, I do. I match everything. I match my shoes with my shirt, with my golf shorts. I don't want to buy my Walmart's clothing. Joys from the golf pro shop at Laughlin Casino or wherever he bought them from. <laughs> you missed I it. told you this was an ugly hole, folks. Yeah, well, you didn't even take the pin out to concentrate because you just thought you'd get it. Triple bogey. Seven. Same thing. Oh. Two triples, folks. You see it here first. That was number 10. First hole in the back. Larry went. Already three uh, bogeys I mean, for the first three holes. Average. We got to get some pars. We need some birdies. We need some eagles. All right. Timmy's up on the box first. Number Maybe 11. Back nine. Talking so much, Tim. People no. could concentrate on their game. My dog is precious. I've got to work on my studio. We need to figure this out. <laughs> <laughs> so I can sit and talk about Tim all day. Oh my goodness. Nice. Get the drive down. That's for sure. That's great. I'm it's recording. Fucking freaking pass out here. You too. Mm. You need to put some and sunscreen on folks. Tim and my professional that's right. that's uh, nursing opinion. Just because your skin looks like it's getting beat up out there. Oh my goodness. He really is. Oh, imagine being married and he's out here golfing all day and you're stuck with all this stuff at the house. Yeah. Tim just out there. You're definitely playing the right side of the golf and fairways. <laughs> all right, shot number two. Timmy's uh, here. I'm just in front of that bunker there. Yeah. I went right on the fairway, so down the middle. Not as bad as I thought it was. I can't believe Timmy's he's sitting perfect. Not got a proper camera. He Probably just another his iPhone. Yards away. <laughs> I mean, you can edit on the iPhone, on iMovie. I'll give him that. But not for the amount of content he puts out. You got your chip shot. Shot your chip shot second. All right. Oh, it's still on, huh? No, it wasn't. Red wasn't on. Now red's on. Mm. We have a term for people like Tim in the UK. It's poser. Tim is a poser. Tim is posing as this, you know, wealthy retiree out enjoying his golf with Timmy Apple Valley at El Rio Golf Club, Fort Mojave, Arizona. Sounds like he's trying to get a sponsorship from El Rio Golf Club at Fort Mojave, Arizona. <laughs> Again, um, shoot, you can learn something from Tim. I'm learning this week. I promise you I'm going to be spending a whole week learning uh, from Tim, all sorts of interesting uh, things. Um, but yeah, he's got the watch. I'd be interested in the watch brand, those $300 sunglasses that he talks about. Maybe he doesn't have those on, but he's, you know, he's always misplacing his $300 sunglasses. Um, he's got that, you know, it's probably all been purchased through his buy me a coffee, but we've never seen him actually buy anybody else a coffee because of course he's got to flash his iPhone because he, how you know he can't get a camera? Oh. Ooh, getting in trouble with okay. that iPhone, Tim. You need to get a camera, but that would be all right. So, we pushed editing. on the uh, See, 100 the problem for the uh, whole number. See, the problem for Tim is that if he gets a camera, that means that he actually needs to spend the time to upload that camera film and put it into something and edit it and you put a thumbnail and actually do proper video production of some sort. 
And that for him is uh, it's a hard pass no, because then he could not put out five, six, seven videos a day and have it that it is um, producing enough revenue and income and views that he's making money because he's not getting, you know, 2.1 million views as he did on the viral SS uh, taking it early videos that he had had. So he has to do this a little differently. And with the phone, he can just make the video. If he feels like he can edit it, he could probably do it inside YouTube. Everything with YouTube is right there on the phone. So he just uploads the video straight on the app. He doesn't do any thumbnails. He doesn't do anything to it. And he just sticks it up and he just hopes that the video by the end of the day has reached a thousand some views with all his 63,000 subs, which he says is 98,000 real people watching. So yeah, that's what we got. <laughs> so the camera, no, he he's, doesn't work for his, you know, production methods, in my opinion, in my thoughts as to why, how he does his content. Ten, right, first hole. Going, I'll be here forever. Uh, no money exchange. Hopefully it will get shorter. And uh, I doubt it. This is our 11th hole. Timmy's in the fairway. I shot mine over there on the right. I think it's in trouble. <laughs> Anything that's going to end this game is the camera conking out. He keeps going right down the middle of the fairway <laughs> in the short grass. He wants that money. Show me the money. He's talking about money. So, are they playing for money on this hole in Arizona? So. Is this what he's doing with the money that people are sending him from buying me a coffee out here gambling it? That's not, it doesn't seem like something that somebody who's out doing Christian devotionals would do. He's mentioned it too many times now for me to think it's a joke. So the only way he could get Timmy Apple Valley out there to play with him is for money? Uh, this Why is there always something strangely problematic with anything that seems starting out quite innocent with Tim. That's why I'm interested and fascinated to actually watch him solidly and react for an entire week. And if you want to be on this journey with me, hit the likes down below. Leave me golf, golf stuff today. Clubs, cards, I don't know, whatever golf. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be really good. I mean, excellent. It's, we see oh. the passing of money at the end? Oh, man, what a shot. <laughs> it doesn't matter, folks, how it gets there. He is on the green in three, and he's putting. And I'm down here. I'm not as bad as I thought I was. I'm in this hole. Playing for a hundred dollar. Mm. Clarification needed, please. Mm. I'm not gonna want to lose money, or other people's buy me a coffee money. We'll have to get some more buy me a coffee. We'll see if he starts talking nice. about paying it forward more. Maybe that's why he talked about it so much yesterday. He was preparing for this golf game. Mm. Look at the watch. See, it's all poser stuff. Oh, I knew it was a great big job. I didn't go by enough. I'll finish it. I'll get you. I have just somebody who's had to work so hard for anything that I've had. You know, I've never been married. So I got a six on a par four. Another time. double bogey after a triple bogey. I just stay single at this point. Oh, look at that. That's unfortunate. Yeah, we know you don't edit around here. Yeah, we don't. Nope. I promise you, I've not watched this. These are always just straight reaction commentaries from me. Uh, and I mentioned that he doesn't do any editing because he just wants to film whatever he's getting on this camera for whatever time we got 28 22 i guess the camera started to get potentially the or iphone i should say was getting hot out in that heat because they don't like the heat which is you know one of the things that their batteries that you they will make sure those things shut down so they don't catch on fire basically and uh tim doesn't edit he just like i said he just wants to put the content out it's not about him trying to show that he's, you know, showing his real golf game. It's just he's a lazy so-and-so, in my opinion. My opinion. My opinion only. Popping out content. He gets a I don't know how it goes. And I'm going to be doing the 
channel killing on my own end this week because I'm going to be watching and reacting to all your content. It's going to kill my algorithm probably. In He's looking left. I didn't see it. it went left. <laughs> Coming around that tree. Top of the tree. All right. Mm. We're almost done, guys. Do the first Tim video. Then I'm going to have to go and get myself the best cup of coffee ever after I take my dog out. This is where things start going south a lot of well. We have fun. So the camera, this is where the camera went south. The uh, $100 bet. Who won the $100? Was there really $100 on the line? I'm not sure. Okay. All right. So we're just going to stop sharing anything at that point. Okay, guys. All right. We got through our first Mammoth Tim video. I don't think he, I don't know if he's got anything else, but whatever he's got, you know, we'll let us know. Was Tim doing any? I simply asked. I said, I wish I could have this dry bag. Well, I mean, how do you know what that is? No, no. Yeah, we know what that is, Tim. So anyway, all right. So that's the first video of this week-long challenge that I have set myself to get to know Tim. And already it seems like he's gambling with money through <laughs> however. I mean, he gets it through his AdSense, but, you know, we're going to see how it feels to just put out content constantly. Uh, thank God the phone died. That's all I can say. All right, guys. If you do like this type of content, one, leave me any type of golf emoji in the chat, any type of golf emoji. I certainly do appreciate it. I got so distracted. I was looking at my dog at one point, but we're going to keep up with it for an entire week. All right, guys, hit the likes on the way out. Um, make sure to subscribe. If you like this type of content, I'm not going to put it on subscribers feed because I don't want to kill you guys this week. So just, just be aware. I'm not going to kill you for any of that. And I did want to thank everybody who is a member of my channel you can obviously easily become a member by just hitting that join button on my page all right guys we'll see you very soon bye